questions and concerns are being raised tonight by many people living in the Nantico Canaver Township areas of Luzerne County. This has to do with a dirt and debris trail that stretches out for miles. The trail has an orange color to it and people want to know where it came from and could it possibly be contaminated? WBRE 28 WYOU 22 News Eyewitness News I team reporter Andy Mahalshik joins us live from the studio. Andy, what have you learned? Well, we learned some answers to questions we did not have this morning. PennDOT was working on an emergency flood protection project at Solomon Creek near the Sand Sweet Parkway in Hanover Township, basically removing debris to help prevent flooding. Some of the sediment from the creek was spilled along the roadways. That has many people asking, does that sediment pose a health hazard to people? Workers using heavy equipment removed debris and sediment from Solomon Creek in Hanover Township on Wednesday. It's all part of an effort to reduce flooding during heavy rains, like we saw with the remnants of Hurricane Ida two weeks ago. The debris is loaded into PennDOT trucks like this one and taken to a composting site on the Earth Conservancy land about five miles away. But orange colored dirt and sediment spilled along the roads leading to that dumping site. This is West Main Street in Nanticoke. It was a, a police officer of ours actually notified me. He was concerned. Um, he was concerned of the stormwater because of all the stormwater regulations and he followed the truck which he believed to be a PennDOT truck and we did verify it was. And especially when they were going up West Main Street, it was really coming out of the back of their trucks. Interim Nanticoke City Manager Donna Wall says the city received complaints from residents. The citizens were concerned about if the runoff from the vehicles were um, had any contamination in it from the dredging of the Solomon Creek. Hanover Township Manager Sam Gusto tells the I team they too received calls from residents expressing concerns. I don't know what could be in that uh, type of uh, sediment because there's two open boreholes upstream of that and I don't know what comes out of that uh, as far as any type of contamination. A PennDOT spokesperson issued a statement to the I team regarding contamination concerns. It reads in part, regarding the colored water, this occurs naturally in streams or seeps fed by groundwater. It is not harmful to humans or aquatic organisms. Iron in soil comes in contact with iron oxidizing bacteria and produces this rusty looking slime. PennDOT says this work is part of an emergency project to clear debris from Solomon Creek to help prevent future flooding. Hanover Township Fire Chief tells Eyewitness News. Well, hopefully this has a huge impact on future flooding. You know, every time it rains, we always have that fear that the roadway is going to get flooded. Uh, last time we had Solomon's Creek come out of its banks uh, because of the debris that was in the creek. And PennDOT will be sending street sweepers to the area to clean up the dirt and sediment. Now you can see the entire PennDOT statement on PAHomepage.com. Reporting for the I-Team, Andy Bohalshi, 2822 Eyewitness News.